Hi guys, my name's James and welcome to this week's plumberparts.co.uk video. Today I'm going to be using my mobile phone with the Velo Assistant app and the Velo Stratos Maxo pumps that we've got behind us here to look at connectivity and how we can use this app to commission and make sure that the pumps that we're installing as engineers are working properly in a commercial setting. Please make sure to hit that subscribe button guys, this is a bit of a controversial video, hopefully a lot of you are going to like it and some of you are going to think what's the point, hopefully at the end of this video you'll know why. Uh, hit that like as well and also comment below. Let's get on with the video, guys. Hold tight. So then guys, the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go onto the App Store and download the Velo Assistant app. It's gonna be very, very helpful when it comes to learning what Velo are like as a company, but also if you don't have one of their pumps yet, you can use that app to learn about the process of linking it all together and how you're actually gonna use it when you do fit a Velo pump. Once you've done that, you're gonna set up a My Velo account. All you're gonna need is your email address and then just follow the steps from there. Then you'll be able to follow me along in this video as we learn about how we can use the app to control the pump, set up a system and commission it, and also run diagnostics as well. Open the Velo Assistant app once you've downloaded it. Once you've watched the introduction and gone through the tutorials, the first thing I do is click on the Smart Connect tab. There you'll see any of the pumps that you've already installed. There's always one in Dortmund, which is a demo mode pump, so you can learn about all the functions of the app if you haven't installed a pump yet. If we click on our site at the studio in Cambridge, you'll see a list of the three Stratos Maxos next to me, which can be reached via Bluetooth. There's a handy traffic light system to let you know if everything's all right. Green means all is okay. Yellow is a warning is present, but the pump is still running. And red, there is an error and the pump has stopped. It will ask us for a pin so we can connect to that pump's local mini network on Bluetooth. Once we've entered that pin, we can enter the pump itself and see how it's running. One of my favorite sections is the monitoring section. You can use the Bluetooth connection to set up the pump. And if the pump is connected to the Velo Smart Gateway, which is planned to be available soon, you'll be able to control it from anywhere in the world. Among other things, you'll be able to see the control modes, the volume flow, fault status, delivery head and power consumption, not to mention the temperature of the water going through the pump at that time. If we go into the pump settings section, you're going to see different parameters that you as the installer can change. If we're installing and configuring a new pump or updating the physical installation parameters of an existing pump so say we add underfloor heating to a system we can put in the system type so underfloor heating or radiators we can have a look at the different types of control mode we've got and we can add additional functions like the no flow stop function so say there's a problem with all the radiator trvs in a house and there's just no flow the pump will recognize that and switch itself off also, if you're installing more than one Velo pump on a property and you know it's going to want the same parameters as the one you've just set up, you can save all those parameters for that pump and then load them into the new pumps when you're installing them. One of my favourite functions is the facility to print out the documentation for a commissioned and installed pump. Customers, insurance companies and building control regulators are going to want to start seeing more of this sort of thing, so it's good if we get up to date and on with this already. And also, it goes some way to showing that you're a more professional installer if you can give them over properly printed out documentation bespoke to that particular installation. There are loads of other handy things that you can use on the Velo Assistant app, one of them being the series and pump manuals for every Velo product ever made, along with pipe calculators and loads more. So then guys, you've learned how easy it is to use the Velo Assistant app. It's a really, really good piece of kit and we've been using it with these Velo Stratos Maxos behind us here today to show you exactly how we can commission them, find out how the system's working right down to what the temperature of the water is to learn more pop over to velo.co.uk i'll leave a link to their stuff below so you can find out more about that please remember to subscribe hit that like button and comment below as to what you think about this the guys from velo will be looking and i'm sure they're going to want to know what you think anyway i'll see you in next week's video guys remember before then to hold tight see you soon